factors affecting the speed of a river. In this module, you learn how the gradient and roughness of channel and the wetted perimeter affect the speed of a river. A river usually originates from melting snow on top of mountains or a lake. Due to gravity, a river always flows downhill and finally enters a sea or an ocean. The path through which a river flows is known as the course of a river. The course of a river has three parts. The upper course, the middle course and the lower course. In each part, the speed of the river varies. The main factors affecting the speed of a river are the gradient and roughness of the channel and the wetted perimeter. The gradient of a river channel greatly affects the speed of the river. The gradient refers to the drop in elevation of the river channel as the river flows downhill. If the gradient is steep, the river flows quickly, whereas if the gradient is gentle, the river flows slowly. In the upper course, the river flows rapidly through a steep gradient. On the other hand, in the middle and the lower course, the river flows slowly through a gentler gradient. Roughness of the river channel also affects the speed of a river. As water flows through a river channel, it encounters obstacles such as rocks, boulders, uneven riverbed, and underwater vegetation. These obstacles cause friction between the water and the channel, slowing down the flow of the river. A river with a smooth channel has fewer obstacles such as rock and boulders and flows at a higher speed due to lesser friction. However, rougher channels will reduce the speed of the river due to higher friction. River channels can be of various shapes and sizes. The shape and size of river channels is affected by the wetted perimeter, which is the length and breadth of the channel that is in contact with the river water. When the wetted perimeter is large, more water comes in contact with the channel, causing more friction. When the friction is high, the flow of the river becomes slow. On the other hand, when the wetted perimeter is small, less water flows along the channel, causing less friction. When friction is less, the flow of the river becomes faster. In this module, you have learned the following. The speed of a river is affected by factors such as gradient of channel, roughness of the channel and wetted perimeter. If the gradient is steep, the river flows quickly, whereas if the gradient is gentle, the river flows slowly. If the river channel is rough, water encounters obstacles such as rocks and boulders, which slow down the flow of the river. River with a smoother channel encounters lesser rocks and boulders and hence has a higher speed. Wetted perimeter is the length and breadth of the channel which comes in contact with the river water. If the wetted perimeter is large, more water comes in contact with the channel. As a result, more friction is generated and flow of the river becomes slow. If the wetted perimeter is small, less water flows through the channel, generating less friction. As a result, the river flows faster.